channel at dinner is served. In today's episode, we are going to make a creamy, rich, delicious and mouth-wateringly tasty dip called hummus. Hummus is a Lebanese dip that is generally eaten with pita bread, but you can eat hummus with breadsticks, with chips, with a toast. It tastes amazing. The best part is that when I was younger and I ate hummus for the first time, I was amazed at how good something can taste with chickpeas because I could only imagine chickpeas in like chole bhature or like a salad. That's it. I couldn't think beyond that. But I was so amazed. I mean, chickpeas can create something so heavenly. And most importantly, everybody, it's quick, easy and tasty. So every time we entertain at home, we generally make hummus as a dip because it's so easy and it's a crowd favorite. So let me take you over the ingredients and we can get started. You will need two and a half cup boiled chickpeas, two tablespoon garlic paste, two tablespoon lime juice, two tablespoon sesame seed paste, pepper half teaspoon salt to taste, three tablespoon olive oil, for the seasoning you will need 5 chopped garlic cloves 1 teaspoon chili flakes 3 tablespoon olive oil I've taken my normal mixer grinder or mixi and in which I'm going to first add the chickpeas the sesame seed paste garlic salt and pepper and lemon juice now I'm going to grind this paste first and make it into a little coarse mixture and then we will add our olive oil a little by little and incorporate it completely into our paste as you can see that now our paste has sort of become a little chunky and I'm going to add half of our olive oil and then give it another blend and then I'm going to repeat the same until it's become into a fine paste. As you can see our hummus is now ready. I blended it into a completely fine paste but if you like it a little chunky and coarse then you can blend it a little lesser and it'll taste the same. So now let's make our seasoning. I've taken my frying pan in which I'm going to add the olive oil. And garlic. So I've added this chopped garlic into cold olive oil because I really want the garlic flavor to infuse into the olive oil completely. So we are going to bring the garlic and the olive oil to temperature together and so that the garlic does not get burnt. As you can see that our garlic is starting to fry in the olive oil. I'm just going to add the chili flakes at this point. I think that's enough. And just let it cook for a few more seconds. I put the flame on a simmer. And I think in about 30 seconds we should be done here. So the second you start to get the aroma of the chili flakes, and the garlic just switch off your gas that's when you know it's done and so our seasoning is ready I got put my hummus into a bowl and I'm just gonna put 
the seasoning into the bowl. Yep. Oh my god, this looks heavenly. Heavenly delicious. And now let's taste it. So our hummus is now ready and I got some pita bread to go along with the hummus from my local supermarket which I lightly toasted. So let's go ahead and try it. It tastes amazing. The hummus tastes good, really good. But the seasoning of the garlic and the chili flakes is what makes it outstanding. The crunchy garlic and the chili flakes are just too good. So you guys have to try it. I want to give a thumbs up to my sister because this is her recipe. So thank you so much. And I really want you guys to try it and give me your feedback. Until next time, dinner is served. It's all about experiencing the joy of cooking. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. If you guys like my video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want updates on my latest videos, please press the bell icon down below. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.